close as you can. So who are you? We are the New York Buddhist Church. Yes. We're a Jodo Shinshu Sangha uh, that was actually founded in uh, brought to New York in the late 1930s. Oh. oh, how long have you been, uh, uh, so is it a, uh, just all Buddhists or do you have a special LGBT congregation or is there no, 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 it's, no, no it's Buddhism without a care as to who you are or where you come from. We believe that you come to us as you are and that's why I love Buddhism. I'm an atheist but I, I am really love it. It's above called Buddhism and atheist religion. So I said, that's for me. Yeah. This particular sect is, uh, does not believe in God. So you can believe in God or not believe in God. That's why I also like the Unitarians. So I'm an atheist, so I could be a minister of the Unitarian religion. So I could be, I could be an atheist Buddhist? Yes. Oh, wow. I could that's be an amazing. atheist Buddhist. My yeah. friend is crazy over Buddhism. No, Buddhism is actually he is atheistic. Really? We believe that God is the creation of man. Oh, wow. Say to anybody interested in Buddhism, because you are. But also, you offer. My friend talks about how much he has been helped by meditation. He's in a very competitive, high-tech, pressure environment, and he goes and he said only Buddhist meditation has made it possible for him to hold on to the job and keep his mind together because he's dealing with all these people, most of them Indian, Dali, or something instead of. It's a small part of our practice. We don't necessarily believe in meditation as a means of achieving merit. Uh, we believe in meditation for its health benefits, for centering oneself. We believe in meditation as a means of expressing our love for other people uh, by doing echo meditation. And what is echo meditation? Uh, or made a meditation. I'm sorry, it should be made a meditation, which is basically just wishing people to be happy, joyous, and free. Wishing them to be free from wants and desires. Wishing them to be free from hurt and illness uh -huh. and pain. And so, even the person who killed all of those people in Orlando is worthy of our concerns for him. He was a tortured, angry person. His yes. whole life was tortured, you know? Absolutely. We just happened to be the one that got the more on the wrong right. place so, at the wrong end when he right. pulled the trigger. We all have a time and a when, a when and a where for us to die. And how can people get in touch with uh, your group? Do you have a website? or? We do have a website. It's NewYorkBuddhistChurch.org. All thrown together. And also, if you Google New York Buddhist Church, that'll come up. Uh, but our sangha is located on 105th Street in Riverside, on Riverside Drive. And do you have certain meeting times? Uh, 11.30 on Sunday. 11.30 on Sunday. Yes, and you see here, we are having a huge dance festival uh, at Bryan Park on July 10th, between 12 and 4. I covered one of those once. I went there. Uh -huh. I went to the I know I went to something in Bryant Park that was a dance festival, and the Buddhists were among the people that were participating. Right. That's well, wonderful. You go to the dance parade? Have you ever heard of the dance parade? Oh, uh, no. Uh, okay. I haven't heard of it, but... What's your name again? My name is Tony Kusumato, and... Well, I'm very happy to meet you. This is our, uh, our Reverend, um, Reverend Earl Tata. Japanese music, so I, I found when they gave me a big applause, I bow. Well, that is a wonderful, uh, wonderful way to express yourself. So thank you. Gary is one of our meditation leaders. Really? Nice to meet you. And what is this about? What is this? I mean, is this just a... It's a bell. To make a little noise. And is that somehow involved? Hi. What does that do? It's the sound of enlightenment. Oh, the sound of enlightenment. So zoom in and hit the bell a couple of times and then end the video.